What up, gang? Now, I promised y'all I was going to give y'all my top picks for reputable breeders or my recommendations as far uh, as places to buy seeds. And I, I'm going to deliver with that. The problem is, is that I don't have too many people on the list that I honestly would um, point you in their direction. But after doing some really good research and compiling some of the connections I've made, you know, throughout my time in the cannabis culture, industry, and community, I came up with some of my favorites in the community, man. So let's get right into it. Like, comment, share, subscribe, you yeah. yeah, you know it. Bitch, I'm posted up with hats and the sleazies. Smoking the Zaza, they go straight to the Mata. Then I'm up in the chopper, hitting the cha cha. Open his Zaza, and I'm dancing my cha cha. Smoking the Zaza, they go straight to the Mata. Then I'm straight to the chopper, hitting the cha cha. Then I'm open his Zaza, and he's dancing my cha cha. Walked in, bitch, I'm outside of some movie. Another thing, don't forget to join the Discord. Smoking the Zaza, they go straight to the Mata. Then I'm up in the chopper, hitting the um, selecting proper genetics for uh, for growing is, is super important, especially if you are someone who takes your craft seriously. Uh, you, you, you ultimately want to make sure that you get your genetics or your seeds from a really reputable breeder, man. And somebody who understands how genetics and the selective breeding process actually works, right? Um, I compiled a list of some of my favorite guys, and I'll be honest, man, I might be a little biased, but um, these are my friends, these are my guys, and these are people that I met in this industry, um, and they caught my attention because I noticed that they do the work. Uh, so, off top, let's start with um, number five. All right, so number five is going to be one of my close friends um one of my students started off as a student and became like a brother um he came to me and he wanted to learn genetics he he, he searched the community and um he wanted to learn the game from a standpoint of science and he didn't want to uh cut any corners uh and um you know he came to me and uh he hit the ground running man and he's learned lesson after lesson um and um I, i'm proud to say man uh gold beer genetics uh my, my brother will be the first to ever graduate my, my breeding program when we uh finally complete the graduation um process and, and 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 put everything together he'll be the first i'm not even ready for it i'm not even ready for him to graduate yet but he's um passed uh you know with flying colors man and he's passed every test with flying colors so uh, i'm excited uh to announce that he has finally created his first strain um you know under my umbrella which i'm very proud to say that's the valley of the sun which is a uh, gushers white gushers cross times dead ops og my dead ops og and um he's been able to create this strain and stabilize traits and um isolate traits uh right uh, uh side by side with me and um uh you know it's, it's been a blessing and it's been a pleasure to have him as one of my students along with all my students and all my friends and family that started off as students and now they just brother and sister i love all you guys um so i'll make sure to put each of my recommendations in the uh you know the comments or well, not the comments but uh in the <laughs> in the description box I'll make sure to put it in the description box and um, So look out for that Alright, shout out, that's number 5 My brother Goldberg Genetics Let's get into number 4 Alright, number 4 is gonna come to you From a brother I met in the community A good friend of mine um, We've been rocking for a while now He actually is from Hawaii You know Aloha, my brother You know, and he's uh, recently Started a new journey up in Thailand, um, but my brother, Hawaiian Grasshopper Genetics, uh, he also is the owner of High Bread Seed. Um, always been impressed with his ability to work. And like I said, when you look around this community, it's, it's rare to find somebody who actually 
takes pride and, and love in actually doing the work of selection when it comes to breeding and making sure uh, that they're isolating these traits for the future growers and uh, removing those undesirable traits. Not just looking or pheno hunting, what everybody likes to use, right? That word, um, that term rather, that everybody loves so much, pheno hunting. Not just pheno hunting for the things that you think are beautiful or great, but actually isolating and selecting to remove those undesirable traits first and foremost is priority to this thing man it's priority to this thing so much love to my brother hawaiian grasshopper uh high bread seed uh, i know at one point in time a couple years ago i don't know no don't hold, don't hold me to this now but um they were doing a dollar a seed two dollars a seed and i will say this all my recommendations you'll notice have one thing in common so at the end of this video i want to see if you put it in the comments i need 100 likes on this video too man Come on, man. I need 100 likes on this video, man. I've been putting in work, man. The website is up, too. ZazaGenetics.com. The website is up. Go check it out, man. Uh, but I've been putting in work. Recording, producing, editing my own videos. Built our own website. Designed it by me. Like, come on. I'm a geneticist by trade. You know, I does this, man. I does many things, man. But I do it all. Out of hard work, dedication, desire, and determination to make sure that me and Team Zaza reach the top, right? So ain't no slowing down, man. You hear me? You hear me? Ain't no slowing down. So look, support, man. Make sure this video gets 100 likes. 100 likes, man. We need 100 likes, man. Run it up. Run it up. And um, if by the end of the video, if you know the one thing, that all of these five breeders or five recommendations have in common, please drop it in the comment section in the description and you're gonna win a pack of my unreleased strain that doesn't even have a name yet, <laughs> but you go with. Or um, you'll be able to pick whatever you want from my from my uh, current, current uh, 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 body of work as well. So. Uh, if you are in the comments, if you're watching the video, wait to the end. Tell me what all these guys got in common and um, drop it in the comments. All right. We need 100 likes on this video, too. So that was my brother. Number four, hybrid seed, grasshopper, Hawaiian grasshopper genetics. Man, I love you, bro. Number three. You're righty. Number three. Number three. Now, my number three selection is are some guys out of Spain who really been putting in the work. And shout out to my breeders and everybody who paved the way in Europe, Spain, Holland, all of these places that, you know, the, I will say one thing over there, they hold true to heirlooms and keeping them consistent and not chopping and screwing everything they get their hands on. Like they do respectfully keep the work of heirlooms consistent and I appreciate them for that. So my number three pick is an auto flower breeder. Y'all can guess this one. Y'all can guess this one. Stop playing with me. This is the best auto flower breeder. I'm not an auto flower breeder. I'm just a breeder. I'm a plant breeder, animal breeder, dogs, da da da. So I, would, I can't put myself in any box, but these guys I'm gonna put in a box and say they're the best auto flower breeders that I've come across. And that's why I, when I created my first strain, Boondocks Glue, which was an auto flower, my intentions was to create a strain that was perfect for new growers as well as experienced growers uh, and consumers as well, right? So um, Boondocks Glue, bam, hit every check that I needed over the last couple years when I uh, finally, but I chose and I did a lot of research to try and find the perfect auto flower breeders so i can find and start with something that was consistent and sex sexually stable something that was potent and and i look no further than mefesto genetics my number three pick shout out to mefesto genetics if you want some solid i will say this mefesto y'all been chucking lately man you heard me y'all been chucking a little bit and i, I respect the game because look at the end of the day it's like look around everybody doing it right and the ones that's doing it they putting money in their pocket so I respect the game man but let me tell you this they built the foundation for the auto flower so 
respectfully, if anybody should be out here or has the right to be out here chucking and making money doing it, they are one. But let me tell you this, they didn't start that way. Um, their artesian line, um, some of the best auto flowers still to this day, man. Um, that form stomper, that uh, 24 carat, three bears OG. I mean, they got classic upon classic upon classic. So shout out to Mephesto Genetics, man. By far, my number three pick overall breeder, but number one when it comes to auto flowers. So shout out to them, man. Number two. All right, so now it's getting a little hard. It's getting a little difficult, you feel me? Now I really got to go in the bag, you feel me? Now I really got to go in my bag and pick some of the best of the best. We talking about internationally. We starting to get into the international bag now, right? So my favorite breeder, and I, I know you're like, damn, but this is only number two. We, we talking recommendations and places that I recommend for you to buy seeds if you want some of the best of the best of the best so um i will have to say my number two choice is gonna have to be Two hours later. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Y'all got me. It's getting too hard, right? It's getting too difficult. Pause. It's getting too difficult, right? It's getting too difficult, right? You hear me? I'll be honest with you. I sat here for weeks trying to deliver y'all this video. I sat here for days, months, pondering and thinking, right? It became really difficult. So ultimately, I cannot suggest. I'm going to have to, for my number two, it's going to have to be like, various European seed banks. And so I got to give you recommendations, but I can't give you one in particular because Soma Seeds, Soma, he's been around for a really long time. Um, older guy, really experienced in the game. I mean, strain hunters, but this is the thing, it gets confusing because the, the and the reason why, all right, so I don't want to give away my answer to the end of the video, but I got to say this, the reason why I have to recommend these guys is it is because that you can even if so let's say hypothetically today they were pollen chucking right uh and they just it doesn't matter because those strains right so these guys are doing like let's take strain hunters in particular they are going out doing the hard work of finding these land race strains they're not making them available to you but they're chucking them and crossing them to make different new stuff for you right so ultimately the good thing about that is that although you are not able to access the land race ancestry yourself you can trace back stuff that you got from them and you know through hard work and selection you're gonna have something sexually stable potent you know these guys are winning cups and they're doing the work so strain hunters soma seeds couple of european uh seed banks that i would recommend for my number two slot man soma seeds and strain hunters shout out to those guys very experienced um check them out i'll put all the information in the, in the, in the uh, you know the description but we got to get to the number one pick man it, it has to go down i bet you my guys know this one man and this ain't gonna be me. Look, my guy said, yo, you gotta make the number one you. You gotta make, I said, I can't do that. That's too biased. Yeah, I am a good option, maybe even the best. No, don't say that. But I, no, I'm just joking. But I will say, I can't pick myself. I have to first pick who I feel is the best besides me. And this, y'all, is my number one my number one is gonna be my brother i met him in this community because i searched far and wide for somebody who understand or understood the mechanics of 
uh, breeding, right? A selective breeding. And not um, just from an animal standpoint, but somebody who specifically knew just from a plant standpoint, this, this plant in particular. And uh, I found my brother Aladdin from Khalifa Genetics, my number one pick, Aladdin from Khalifa Genetics. What is up, growers? This is Aladdin from Khalifa Genetics. And what we're gonna cover today is cannabis hermaphrodites. Why do so many plants harm? You could check any of his videos out. He understands the complexity and the science of selective breeding. He understands the language, homozygosity and heterozygosity are just basic terms. When those are just the basic terms for you, then you have now gave yourself a good foundation of ground knowledge to become a breeder. And um, if you want some good foundation ground knowledge, that's the place to start, man. Um, check out Aladdin. I'm also an official uh, uh, vendor or distributor for his, uh, his genetics. So um, if you need anything on his website and you're here in the US, hit us up, man. Um, you can hit me up directly or you can check out zazagenetics.com. Um, and, and, and you know, take care of you, man. But that's my number one pick, man. That's my brother. I met him in this community, man. And we had we've had talks uh, about breeding, and, and, and you know, I've picked his brain, and he's you know picked my brain. And um, shout out to him, um, who I would consider the best that you guys have to offer here in this cannabis community. Um, problem is, he's all the way in Spain, so. I'm ready. I'm ready for that next round of talented, young, uh, 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 aspiring breeders, man, to hit this community running, man. My next gold beer genetics to 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 hit hit this community and take off, man, with with, with knowledge and wisdom and understanding and good practice. So, um, if you are that next aspiring breeder and you want to learn this thing the right way tap in with us and hit up the patreon or tap in with me directly on instagram find a way to reach out to me and we'll get you right man just like all my other guys man shout out to team zaza i love each and every one of you guys um stones i'm so proud of you dose bros genetics my brother has um become uh you know, and I'm over here all getting wrapped up in my breeding, right? But Dos Bros Genetics has officially become Team Zaza's mycology technician. Um, he has uh, took himself through hell and back with, with knowledge and, um, and, 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 and ground level education. And um, I'm so proud of you, brother. I love you. Uh, I look forward to, to this journey um, uh, and watching you take off like a rocket and a shining star, brother. Uh, until we meet again, man. Listen, what y'all want to see now? I told y'all I was going to give y'all my picks, man. Huh? I told y'all I was going to give y'all my picks. They're like, man, that little list, man, that ain't nothing, huh? That ain't nothing, man. Hey, I told you, I don't know. It took me like two weeks to deliver it, and it was only a couple. One of them was mine. One of them was my brother. <laughs> hey, so that should tell you how hard it is, pause, to find good, reputable breeders in this community. I, listen, what y'all want me to go to? The big dogs up top with the big brands and the big cup? They don't know what they do. They are retailers. Don't get it twisted. They don't tell, they don't. They can sell you a fire eighth packaged up, but they don't know this game, man. Don't let it fool you. Understand the basic knowledge so you can start to recognize the more advanced that come at you, all right? So drop it in the comments. Remember, we need 100 likes on this video. And remember, listen, you win a pack if you can tell me what all five of my breeders have in common. Love y'all. Make sure y'all visit acinfinity.com. Hit Team Zaza at checkout. That's the coupon code, Team Zaza. And make sure you check out the site, zazagenetics.com. Even if you're going to look, the desktop version, I completed. I did it myself. The, the mobile version, I'm still working on, so don't judge me, all right? But check that desktop version out when you get a chance, man. Let me know what you think in the comments, man. Love y'all, man. Peace. I'm out.